plants, land, powered, powered, cyclists. cyclists. Achha, uh, Action. Okay, so we have Andy with us. He is from the US. And we are asking him how his experience was in Pakistan. Andy, how are you? Good, man. And you? So, uh -huh. for how long have you, uh, you, you have been traveling to Pakistan? I've been here for two weeks now. Okay, and uh, you have covered which of the places? Uh, I came from China, so I'm okay. working so my way south. Kunjurab border? Yeah, Kunjurab down to... So, do you have anything to say regarding the hospitality to people of Pakistan? Uh, so far it's been pretty great. Uh, people let me camp for free at their place, let me take hot showers, uh, me give me apples, bananas, or whatever. Anything they can do to help. Okay. Yeah. So, they made your uh, trip quite amazing? Yeah, they made me feel a lot more comfortable. You feel you felt at home? Yeah, because, okay. you know, Pakistan's had a bad reputation, exactly. according to the news, exactly. For, the, exactly. for so long. And, Coming but you here. have experienced it personally. So yeah. can you encourage all of the tourists around the world to come visit Pakistan? <laughs> Without a doubt. Yeah, Pakistan's safe, great people, great food, um, amazing places. The scenery is amazing. Um, yeah. So are you planning to come back next year or not? Uh, probably not. My probably lifestyle, not. I keep moving country place to country. Place to place. Yeah, yeah. Country to country. Okay. Uh, maybe again in a few years. Who knows? Okay. okay. Thank you, Andy. Yeah, you're Thank welcome. Thank you so much for your time. Yeah, no problem. I wish you good luck. Appreciate Thank it. You. Thank you. Thank you. to Rakaposhi Base Camp. I'm on my way to Rakaposhi Base Camp. The weather turned out in my favor. It was supposed to be really cloudy. For some reason, they disappeared. It's clear sky. I'm a happy guy. It's gonna be an amazing hike. Can't wait to show you guys all the videos and photos. closer the snow's starting to get pretty deep <laughs> about five or six inches deep so it's uh, a bit harder to walk up here with tennis shoes on but I'm almost there let's hopefully some of the snow's melted on the top all right getting a bit deeper now it's about a foot and a half there <laughs> Almost there, almost there. There's the base camp. Made it. And there's Rakaposh. It's 
So to get to Rakaposhi, you wind along this ridge, and you go up and up and up, and boom. Easy piece of cake. There's Mount Diran trying to get the clouds away. I'm at the base camp at Rakaposhi. Um, it's a bit, there's, a, there's some clouds in the sky, but really, these views are incredible. I could only hope to do this again when there's less snow and I can hike over to Diran and camp there for a night and then come back. This is just a special area. It's so beautiful out here. That was crazy. <laughs> Just got back from Rekaposhi and I was wondering what all the noise was. I think they, they beat themselves um, because someone else died and they're, uh, it's part of some religious event. I'll figure it out later. Just as I was leaving Mini Pin, I, I felt like something was wrong with my tire and sure enough I had a flat. So I took the tire off and I took the tube out, but I made sure not to move the, the tire itself. When I actually located the flat, I could kind of put it back onto the tire itself. I could locate more or less the problematic area and I was able to find a little piece of metal sticking through. So this time it wasn't a thorn from back in Tajikistan, but yeah, I got to get this little piece of metal out. Well, that was fun. <laughs> there goes an hour. So I still got 75 kilometers to go to get to Gilgit. It's 12 o'clock. Maybe a wild camp tonight. We'll see. Hello. This is the Rakaposhi viewpoint. A bit cloudy. It was better yesterday. I'm cruising along the airport, almost there. It's getting dark. Uh, it's hard to see. Oh, there's a car right in my face now, but. I keep going to the right side of the road. I'm supposed to be on the left. Almost there.
Gates. Kale, where are we, man? Uh, just underneath the Kaga Buddha, outside Gilgit, Pakistan. Yeah, How's man. Let's go check it out. Oh, don't miss your step. Oh, where are you going, Kale? You coming up? I'm leaving Gilgit, it's a good break, four days off, I'm ready to move on, it's a trial, here we come.